Hey everybody, welcome to another review. Um, tonight I got a request uh, maybe a couple days ago to test uh, Sophos, or however else it's pronounced, um, internet security here. So I downloaded a trial of it. It was uh, 37.6 megabytes. I got uh, 10 brand new URLs, um, same ones that I used to test Node32. And uh, we're going to do a review here. Like I said, uh, I'm just going to try to keep it to one video. So I might be pausing the video now and then while it's doing things that are taking too long. Um, mainly because I'd like to keep it to one, keep it concise. You know, yeah, if maybe I could, you know, do a 15 minute video and not have to chop it up and upload multiple videos and all that stuff. Maybe I could, but yeah, I'm not a. Uh, YouTube partner yet so I get 10 minutes here so I try to be as fast as I can okay we're gonna install it and it's uh, regular we're gonna enter these later we're gonna install the firewall we don't have any third-party security software to worry about and let's install it here I'm gonna turn on my networking card in case it needs to download anything and let's see here see how fast this is at installing. This is endpoint security and control. So uh, it's a trial version. And while this is installing here, I'm going to pause it. And if anything new pops up, I'm going to come back to you guys. All right, be back in a second. OK, it uh, finished installing here. And uh, what it's asking for is to restart the computer. So I'm going to restart the computer and I will be back when it's all done restarting. See you in a second. Okay, the uh, computer's restarting now. So uh, we'll restart it, <clears throat> get some updates, and uh, do some testing. Okay, computer's restarted, and uh, we got a generic host process. So uh, we're going to create a, uh, we're going to allow all activity for this application because we know this is a uh, clean PC. We installed a firewall too. So let's uh, update the software. Let's open it up and let's check out what the user interface looks like. Okay, it looks like standard Windows uh, user interface, which is fine. You know, sometimes it's better not to mess with something that works. So let's go, let's see, on access scanning here. Scanning level, scanning options. We're not going to mess with any of these. I'm just taking a look at them because I've never used this antivirus before. So uh, let's see. On demand and exclusions, we're not going to mess with that. Looks like it has a hips. So, uh, okay, we're going to leave that just the way it is. Right click scanning, updating, dating options. Okay, the update failed for some odd reason. Could not connect a server. Oh, gee, of course, fun. So, give me a second here. Let me uh, figure out how to get the updates now. So, give me one second. Okay, because for some odd reason I can't get it to connect to the server, I went online and downloaded the uh, signature files from Sophos. So, uh, I downloaded it was an exe, and it's going to extract all the signatures right now, the newest ones that they had online, and it's going to update them. I hope. Oh, gee, of course. That's real nice. Okay, so I, I know what happened here. Hold on one second. Okay, everybody, I finally got the downloads working here. Uh, what I had to do is I had to uh, register online for trial, get a username and password. So as you can see, the downloads are finally working. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to pause the video again while these are downloading because this is package one of three and I'm not sure how long the other ones are going to take. So I'll be back when this is done. See you in a second. Okay, the updates are all done. And uh, 
should be good here. Well, that's checking one more time. Okay, it's downloading again. Okay. Anyway, I just want to show you guys what it, uh, the memory that it uses here. It uses a decent amount of memory. You got 45. Uh, let's see, Explorer. Um, let's see here. Right there, right there, right there. That's the updater and stuff. Right there, right there, right there, right there. I mean, it's got a decent amount of processes and stuff running in the background. So, okay, this is, is going to download again. Uh, it did download an update for the program, I guess. So, uh, I guess I'm going to pause this and I'll be back when it's all done. See you in a second again. Okay, everybody, I finally got uh, Sophos updated here. It took forever. But I got it updated. Let, let's do some tests. I got about four minutes here to get these done. So, uh, let's hit them hard and hit them fast here. If they work. Okay, so that one got blocked, so that's good. Let's move on to the uh, second one here. If you run it, nothing will happen. I'm just going to keep going one after the other. Okay, I uh, got a firewall thing. Uh, pop up, so let's uh, just let that go out and see what happens. Hips blocked it, so that's good. Okay, so I didn't block it, but it says send it to Please send a sample, but there's nothing for me to send to. Okay, that's weird. Okay. Okay, I guess ActiveX isn't working that well anymore. Okay, that got blocked. Generic. It's requested network access, so we'll let it get network access for now. And, uh, okay, see, the HIPS is uh, trying to take care of that one. This is again the firewall, so we'll just give it network access, as you can see. So let's see what happens here. We'll just uh, keep going on. It's giving me all these things to send samples to, but there's nothing that I can use to send a sample with. This is just the firewall popping up warnings here. And it's telling me that it's recognized as suspicious, be suspicious behavior, but it's not giving me an option to turn it off, which is weird. That one might not work. Let me close this out and open up a new uh, Internet Explorer, because I know those couple of ones should have worked. That's just weird that it's telling me that the hips... Okay, I, I remember what that was from the hips. Okay. See, the problem is that in its stock configuration... Um, I'll stop updating. In its stock configuration, it, um, it just lets you know on the hips. So you'd actually have to turn off alert only um, to actually get any kind of Maybe you get some kind of option. That I hope you do. Let's try another one of these that I know had the hips do something. Ah, okay, it looks like this video is going to have to go into video two, so I will be.